In this tutorial, I'll walk you through the K-Mayo, providing an overview of its features including the second channel, electrode application, usage, and its diverse applications. The K-Mayo is a surface electromyography or EMG sensor designed to capture the electrical activity of our muscles. For this purpose, we have a primary channel located at the back where we can affix the electrodes. Here we go. This is the first channel, and we have the option to add a second channel, enabling monitoring both agonist and antagonist muscles or engaging in targeted exercises. I'll connect the cable to the small K-Myo box and use three electrodes instead of two. I'll place them on the red and white colors for measurement and the black, which will be affixed to the bony landmark, to enhance the signal. When placing electrodes on the device, the distance between the electrodes is predetermined. For the second channel, Optimal Surface EMG Practice recommends maintaining a distance between the red and white electrodes no greater than 4 cm and no less than 1 cm. This is crucial for optimal signal reception. Beyond 4 cm, there is a risk of the signal attempting to capture intermuscular activity, delving too deep and picking up signals from deeper muscles. Conversely, if the electrodes are too close, the signal may not descend far enough to detect the muscle's electrical activity. With our K-Myo, we can conduct assessments and simultaneously integrate training exercises, as demonstrated in a tutorial focusing on quadriceps training post-recovery especially after ligamentoplasty for quadriceps reactivation.